Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Raquaza, and this is Noida again. I'm back. This is the daily run for December 20th, 2019. What the hell? No, that's the build. December 20th, 2019. It hasn't updated. It's the 5th today. Uh, this is Ma Slush. It's slushy out here. We are starting with a chaotic polymorphine flask, a spitter bolt wand. That's weird. And a rain cloud spell. Um, I haven't played a lot of Noida lately on stream. Or on camera, rather. Or off camera, for that matter. It's just been a lot of uh, neither of those things. Wow. Can you imagine if it actually snowed like this, where it would just come down and be this liquid ooze? I, I can only imagine. It does not do that here. We really haven't had snow. We didn't get snow this year. I guess there's still time, potentially, but it's doubtful. Um... We're playing on the daily run mode. I'm not playing Nightmare. You know what? As far as I'm concerned, there is no Nightmare mode until I beat the game. It's, uh, it's impossible. It cannot be done. I will never beat Noida. But you know what? We're gonna try. We have an egg. I haven't really decided what eggs are good for. Also, I haven't decided what war is good for. Uh, look, it's been a while, all right. I gotta, I gotta warm up the joke machine. It can't, they can't, can't all be winners. It might take a minute. Oh, we got a digging wand. Please. I only have a spitter bolt wand. Please don't do horrible things. Oh, okay. Um, yes. Energy balls. Pretty solid. Arrows, also pretty solid. Worse in every way than this one, except it doesn't shuffle, but it only has three capacities. So, I don't know, dude. Uh, is it better than our spitter bolt wand? Like... Yes. In every measurable way, I think. Yes. Perhaps. Other than the cast speed, I guess. Cast speed is significantly worse, but I would rather have the arrows than the... One. <clears throat> Sorry, than the... Uh... Okay, we danced around it. It's fine. Rather have the arrows than the other thing. But I would rather have this. Super balls are. have other uses. We need. Uh, this is chaotic polymorphine. I don't like being on fire, really. Uh, kinda sucks, to be honest. should pick up this flask. At the very least, I can make it into uh, something else. Put the rain... We have a rain cloud wand. What the heck is my problem? Yeah, you know what we'll do? Chug the slime flask. It's gonna kill us. I didn't realize that. I feel like I had this issue earlier, where I drank slime flask early on, and then I just drank some water down to replace it, kind of. I don't know if that actually, how that actually works. But, uh, maybe the slime poisoning is lessened because I watered it down in there, you know? I don't know. That's a mechanic that I don't have fully figured out yet. Uh, so we do have a fire making wand available to us if such a thing is necessary. It might be, in fact. Ideally, 
what we could do is maybe... Oh yeah, there we go. Get some fire going up here. And then he can throw another... Yeah, there we go. It's working. It's spreading. It'll happen. 20 years from now. It's working though, you know? We did it. We achieved our goals without... Uh, actually doing anything. Oh no, the treasure chest is burning. Oh no. Get it. Oh, it's a bomb. This was not worth it. Give me water. I have a water flask and a freaking... What am I doing, dude? I'm Rusty. Hello, I'm Rusty. What's your name? I have committed an error. What have I done? I could have killed them with the rain cloud, potentially. I can still use the rain cloud. Give me this money. We use the rain cloud in order to put out the lava in order to get that money. Make that money. Get that bread. Show me the money. We're doing not great on health, but we are getting to a point in our lives where that's okay because we're getting close-ish to an exit, potentially, unless I die right here, which is a potential possibility. Ooh. Spicy boy. We got some dog business. Don't kill me acid. Kill dynamite man. Okay, wonderful. I mean, I'm gonna keep poking my head around until I see something truly calamitous. Uh... We have this, which is a very large boom. Ambrosia flask! You know, okay, thoughts on using the Ambrosia Flask. Was that on, did I record that and put it up? So, there was a time at some point in the recent past where I was in an Ambrosia Flask because Ambrosia Flasks give you, oh, that's nice. It's like an immortality drink. And if you stand in it, then you're immortal. But I was trying to get into it because I had been knocked back out of it or something, and then I died. But uh, we might be able to use that effectively if we save the Ambrosia Flask. I'm not exactly sure how it works totally, but... Okay, so hold on. What do we got here? These give minus cast delay. I don't know. This has worse mana charge speed. What if we do two of these? What if we do one of these? Four of these. Heck, let's just do this. This seems good. It seems good to me. Uh, keep the rain cloud. Keep the black hole. I don't want to... We'll get rid of the black hole for now. We don't need it at the moment. I'm hoping. We got rocks. Let's see. What do we got? 
very low cast time and recharge delay. Does the recharge delay... It isn't dynamically updated as you remove spells. So these give minus 3 or 0.3 cast delay. So you really only need one in here. Because that's at like the minimum cast delay anyway. Maybe they aren't good to use anymore. Maybe they nerfed the cast delay reduction that Bouncing Burst gives. I don't know. I don't know how it works. This seems more effective than the other one does, though. So hold on, we're looking. We would be looking for a very low cast delay and recharge time replacement. Um, and none of these appear to be that. I mean, in general, like the first floor wands, not that impressive. But. So, repelling cape is good. And I think I will take it. Let's just cleanse stains more easily at the cost of, like, being lit on fire is slightly more dangerous. Fly downwards very high recharge time. You know, what an interesting interesting spell, or interesting wand. Not horrible. Really. Don't do it. My concern is that oh no. As this, like, the longer we go with this spell setup, the less useful it's going to be, unless we get damage in there somehow. Give me safety. Thank you. a wand here. We also don't have any digging power to speak of. We also, we do have the um, ability to create a rain cloud at will. So this, this won't break open this wall. Okay, careful there, buddy. Excellent. That worked better than I could have hoped. This, however... <laughs> it's working worse. Uh, I don't think that would have opened that wall. But, you know. What do we got here? Oh, Lord. Always cast Fireball Thrower, Giant Firebolt, ex Explosion on Slimy Enemies. That's a horrifying wand that we are missing several perks uh, before using that is remotely safe. Okay. Please don't murder me. There's a wand there. Uh, always cast personal fireball thrower. Causes the creatures hit by the projectile to cast fireballs in random directions. That's different. Than regular fireball thrower. Maybe better. Also, spells per cast are five. This is an insane wand, honestly. Check this out. This is an insane wand. Absolutely nuts. I'm I'm terrified of this wand. So theoretically this burst of air if it hits an enemy Yeah is gonna do horrible things. Horrendous earth shatteringly scary. Yup. It's bad, dude. but so good.
Oh, it also is electric. Don't uh, have it equipped when you're in water. That's that's a spooky thing. Electric charge. That's the one weakness of electric charge is that you can kill yourself with it pretty easily. Baby. Don't kill me. You know what? Douse me, but. I'm out of juice. Okay, we're gonna put this in the third slot. Oh, you're scary. You know what? You know, sometimes when you're in a panic place, it's okay to use mundane methods of killing people, such as a million freaking bouncy balls, because that's the safe choice. It's okay to take the safe option. We're being safe, it's fine. We have stainless armor, it's good. Stainless cape. Nice for getting that slime off. Slime on, slime off. I, I do think that this personal fireball thrower is insane though. Because if it doesn't, I don't know. We haven't, we haven't really found an enemy that matters enough yet. I like this fire. I don't know. I want Maybe I should have used this on the purple boy. I need to find something with a lot of HP to see how much this does. Because I've never actually used personal fireball thrower. I didn't even realize until, like, right now that um, personal fireball thrower and fireball thrower were two different things. I didn't think that that was a thing. Those are going to burn. I think this is pretty good. <clears throat> I'm wondering if we put it on our bouncy ball, or put our bouncy balls in there, if that's... Well, that could be bad, too, because we could hit ourselves. I don't know if that works with the bouncy balls. Uh, this is a teleport wand, but it's a chaotic path teleport wand. It is better mana regen. No, it's not. Look at the mana recharge on this wand. That's insane. That's actually a great wand, too. You know what? Give me... put this here. So that I can quickly, if need be, swap to a safe alternative wand that will create water in case I am in dire straits. Is this a dead end? Yes, it is. Please light on fire. Is that lit on fire? I don't know, there's a small smoldering ember there. Not quite what I'm looking for, it has been put out. There we go, that's what we're talking about probably. I didn't start the fire, except I did, don't listen to me. that I was lying earlier. I hate that our digging. Wand is breath of air. It's just not very good at what it does. We really don't have digging, to be truthful. Ah! 
Oh, here we go. You are a pretty good test, honestly, of whether we're actually damaging enemies or not. And you know, I think we might be damaging enemies a lot. If we hit them. How much damage does Breath of Air do? I hate that! Who threw that? <laughs> That's your fired. Does six damage. Does it just inherently... cause the enemies to fly apart as a result of... I don't know, the force of the air blast? Maybe. I'm just... I'm so mad. It really just does. You hate to see it, really. It's a classic death. I, I knew that I was supposed to not do that. But I did it anyway. <sighs> Why? I don't know, dude. I was trying to, like... I was looking at my hot bar. I was trying to fill up my flask with water. And I just, you know, moused over the wrong one. It, it... We were about to go into the teleporter anyway. It did freaking, like, 70 damage in an instant. But I guess that's what happens when you throw a toaster into the water. Into the bathtub, you know. It does about 70 damage. We only have, you know, 50 health on average as humans at level 1. So unless you get a lucky roll on a, like a constitution save or something, then you're just dead. That's in real life, so I guess the game, you know, isn't as complex as real life, but it does at least uh, attempt some sort of irony or, you know, maybe, I don't know. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Take it easy. Bye-bye.